everybody how you doing long time no see i'm so excited you know for me to be on this side and you are on the other side so we can have this chit chat guys it's always amazing when you get on here guys remember that you are amazing and you are a beautiful person today i want to talk about the kind of guys that you should not date yeah these kind of men don't date them without further ado guys i just want to tell you please go ahead touch that subscribe button Give me a thumbs up, like, share, guys. And I'm telling you so that when I upload a video, don't forget to touch that bell so that each time I upload a video, you will surely get a notification. So in today's video, I wanted to talk about the kind of men that you should not date. Don't date, number one, don't date a guy that has a different vision from you. I always say this all the time. You may not necessarily control who is going to ask you out. But you can control who you will say a yes to because you are just you're not just dating like oh let's just date to have fun let's date without purpose or without a focus you are dating because you have a vision you have a purpose you have a focus you are dating for something right it could be marriage so that is it um, are you do you think you will marry this person maybe they, they love you you love them and you guys want to make things work and all those kind of good stuff yeah so why are you dating them because definitely you want to be with that person spend the rest of your life with that person and fulfill purpose together so the first reason for you is that you want to marry someone so don't date somebody simply because in quote oh i just like them no don't date someone who you guys have opposite or antagonistic, you know, of visions. It's not going to work. So don't waste your time, your energy, and everything that you, you care about to waste on those kind of people. The second kind of thing, guys, or guys, rather, that you cannot date is somebody who doesn't love God. Don't date a guy that doesn't love God. Don't because that would be the worst thing that can happen to you having different uh, religions having antagonistic kind of beliefs don't date that kind of a person you don't want to date someone who you for example say you love god so much and they tell you oh there's no god then you're just wasting your time because when you finally be with them you yourself would say oh one day probably say there's no god or you probably say you know what i'm done i'm sick and tired of this i don't think i want to do this anymore don't do that the next thing guys don't date a poor guy now when i say poor i know some people may be laughing and cracking you think sometimes people think that when they say a poor person they think it's only about money don't date a guy that is poor intellectually there are some guys that don't have money in their pockets but they are very rich upstairs so don't date a guy who is very poor upstairs intellectually poor is a very bad thing because they will never want to work for their vision because first of all if they are poor intellectually they don't probably have a vision so they will not work on a vision they will not hustle or do their best to be a better version of themselves they will not be able to believe in you they will not even be able to bring food on the table it's not about having all the money in the world but it's about going out there doing your best to make sure that you have even is a dollar is accounted for and you work hard for it and it's a legit kind of thing guys you don't want to date such kind of people because i'm telling you that you will realize that hey you know what i'm just wasting my time with this person because intellectually they are so poor and malnourished you don't want to be with those kind of people guys the fourth kind of guys that you shouldn't date guys i'm telling you beautiful ladies is somebody who doesn't even believe in you I know somebody will tell me that oh my gosh i know that you know um uh, believing in somebody involves trust and you get to know with time and all of that but before so you want to marry somebody or before dating someone you should have known them to some degree of uh, you know level you can't just meet someone today and you say oh my gosh yeah or they ask for your number and they say oh i really like you just say yeah no you have to see how they align in your own purpose if somebody does not even believe in your goal does not even support you support your dreams and everything that you stand for then i'm telling you that you can't even you shouldn't even date that kind of a person because that relationship is not going to work don't get me wrong i'm not saying that he's gonna accept and approve everything you say no you guys may probably say have some misunderstandings here and they're like oh no don't do it this way i think you should do it this way it's gonna be better 
that's a good thing but what i'm saying is this guy doesn't believe in you all the time he's always like oh i don't think you can do this you're not good enough for this that's not for you no he's never supporting your dreams and he doesn't even want to bring anything for you to pursue as well on the table don't date those kind of people guys today those are the four kind of people that you should not date you shouldn't be with them because i'm telling you it's gonna waste your time your money your energy your resources and everything that you believe in and i'm telling you if you go out there being with the wrong kind of people all the time you will definitely lose your self-worth you don't want to do that guys remember you are beautiful you are the beauty of christ until next time guys it's plenty of love from me to you guys